tell us all you know about your mother's spell book. Why do you care about that? Judging by the way Cassandra risked her own neck to get that book back, I am more convinced than ever that it holds the key to darkness reigning over Skylands. And you are going to help us discover what secrets the book and your mother keep. Not to when you're flying hundreds of feet above them. Now you're thinking, Spyro, you are on fire. Yeah, that's because I can also, you know, breathe fire. <laughs> and? And you may applaud or blush, whatever you need to do to display your awe. I can wait. Well, <laughs> every dragon has those abilities. I'm talking about the special superpower that only you have, which makes you an integral part of the team. Well, like I said, I think if you just... Uh, it reminds me of... <clears throat> uh, uh, things, non-dragon things. Appreciate the offer, dude, but I'm just gonna pour a potion where the podium was to lift fingerprints. Now, I only need one tiny drop to make the prints appear. Well, at least let me use my incredible sense of smell to help you sniff out the perp. Sweat this perp. And how are you going to get him to talk? Everyone knows my secret superpower is my magic gaze of truth. All I have to do is look into someone's eyes, then boom, they are spilling their guts. I'm gonna get a donut. Oh, since I'm basically a lie detector myself, one could even say it's my superpower. False. Ah! Are you okay, Spyro? Ever since your interview, you've been acting kind of weird. You don't need to prove anything. We know how awesome you are. I am not trying to prove anything to anybody. Super false. Sad twangy. Sorry, but you've been acting emo all day. What is going on? Seriously, you hardly lifted a talent during the investigation. You want to know why I hardly did anything? Because I can't do anything! You guys have your speed and lava and magic and your sweet weapons, and I've got nothing. Don't you think you're being a little hard on yourself? Yes! And I'm not gonna stop being that way until I discover what my special superpower is. I've never seen Spyro like this before. I guess the whole not having superpowers thing really has him down in the dump. Fine, I don't have fly superpowers or super fly powers. Is that what you want to hear, huh? I'm just a powerless nobody with lame dragon abilities. Ugh. Don't you realize I would do anything to have what you call lame dragon abilities? Ditto. I'd even do anything to have fingers so I could make air quotes. It's just not fair. Why am I the only Skylander without something exceptional about him? Well, maybe you'd learn if there's something more exceptional about you if you spoke to another dragon. Like that, keep doing your normal routine, and maybe a new power will reveal itself that way. So what you're saying is that I just need to put myself in a situation that would force my hidden superpowers to come out. Brilliant! Thanks, Eruptor. I don't think I said any of that. The cadets. The effects of coordinated belligerent stimuli on latent preternatural abilities. The effects of recklessly attacking me so I can discover what superpower I have. <laughs> Come on, food fight. Let's see what you're made of. Besides, um, artichoke. No. Oh, mm. Well, looks like I don't have super speed, but thanks for lunch. Prepare to smell my wrath. Yeah, you know what, Bad Breath? Why don't you sit this one out? Okay, Spyro, you've had your fun. Let's wrap it up now, okay? You're right. It's time to speed this up. New plan! Everyone attack me at once! Yeah. Cadets, cease and desist! Spyro, come see me. Now. Mm. Ah, Spyro. I'm very disappointed in you. Your recent erratic behavior has been a huge distraction, not to mention incredibly dangerous. You leave me no choice but to suspend you from the team until you get your head on straight. But Eon... What's next? Fighting a villain on your own to force your superpower to manifest itself? You're right, Master Eon. I've been selfish and put the team at risk. <sighs> I'll go file the paper. Okay, superpowers. If you're in there, now is a great time to show yourself. Wait, 
All my life, I thought I was special, but it turns out I'm just a regular old dragon with no superpowers. You mean I almost wasted my precious bomb on a dragon with no bloody special powers? <sighs> because I'd much rather use it on something totally bomb-worthy. Spyro, <laughs> he's gone. I wouldn't be so sure about that. <gasps> yeah! Spyro! I don't believe it! I don't either! That blast should have turned me into Seared Skylander! How is this possible? Whoa! I'll tell you how. Your dragon scales have become completely impenetrable. Shut the front door! That sounds like a super power! <laughs> this is incredible! I have a power! An actual superpower! An actual not regular dragon superpower! Quick, somebody pinch me. You're not dreaming, Spyro. No, oh, I know. I just want to test my impenetrability. Come on, pinch me. Ow! I didn't say hard. Well, now that I've discovered my impenetrable scales, I have the chance to become truly great. In all my years, I've seen many with superpowers come and go, and they've taught me one thing. It's not powers that make one great. It's how one uses those powers. Well, if this power is only manifesting now, Maybe there are others left to discuss. Your Guildedness, might I offer a suggestion? If you use your power to turn the guards into gold, that will buy some time to figure out how to disarm the gates. Not now, Chaos. Guards, arrest them all! If I'd only used my power to turn the guards into gold, so we could have bought some time to figure out how to disarm the gates. That was my idea! <laughs> Just gonna sit there, or are you going to escape? Good work today, Chaos. You put on a heck of a show with them there pals of yours. Get stuff, Pepperjack. I've had enough sarcasm for today. No, no, we mean it. You really saved our hides. Cram both your chomp holes. I know when I'm being made fun of, and I can't take it anymore. Don't you get it? The Doom Raiders. Each and every one of you are my idols. I worship the ground you walk on, and in unique individual cases, float over. All I've ever wanted is to prove myself in the hopes you would accept me as one of your own. Is that too much to ask? Chaos, we accept you as one of our own. And in the wake of your ever-developing powers, it's clear you're stronger than I gave you credit for. From the I also realize there's so much about my kind I don't even know. If I want to be the best Skylander I can be, I need to learn everything about my ancestors. Uh, a noble quest, but never forget about all your more pressing responsibilities at the Academy. I won't, Master Eon. And hey, thanks. I had a feeling this day might come, which means it's time to make sure appropriate measures are put into place to keep certain secrets just that. Secret.